So uh, another idea, um, I guess we'll just we'll just go from something like a headlock. Um, again, you really shouldn't be someone shouldn't really be getting you a headlock in the first place. But if you find yourself in a headlock, um, basically, hold on, you want you want to do the same the same thing we did with our neck. Um, your whole spine should operate that way. Um, so as our spine moves around. Um, it's moving the same way that I described the neck moves around. I mean, that's just a small section of the spine. This is a, a larger section. So if he has me in a, in a headlock and, and, and I'm bent and whatnot, um, and obviously there's external strategies to get out of this, all of which rely on my speed and power, um, none of which really involves me standing up. And if I try to stand up, and I'm forceful about this, make sure you have me good, there's a struggle here, and it's just cranking on my neck. And keep me good, keep me strong. So if, if I'm keeping my neck open and my spine free, then all of a sudden I can just stand up. Um, because what he's doing is not landing in me, uh, not fighting back, I'm keeping loose and open. Um, now as far as uh, Marshall, I mean that, that gets me up out of it. Um, if I'm doing other things at the same time, go ahead. Uh, if I do something here or back here at the same time as I'm standing up, and again, just being loose and open about this, so I've got to make sure it's really good. Good. All right, so uh, this is good. <laughs> anyway, um, again, this stays loose and open. I'm just going to stand up with ease, <laughs> and then I can, if I'm just doing other things, it's going to. I don't want to dump him on the ground, but it's going to affect his body in a different way. Um, and one more time. E e go ahead. Even if I stay here, I can actually open him up this way. Um, be strong. So if, if I'm pushing, I can't do a lot here. He could. He could easily fight me. Um, if I'm loose, open about this, that just sends him right down. I just have one thing. If I would have involved my other arm as he was going down, I could have got control of what's happening, move in, whatever. But loose and open movements afford you a lot of freedom in what you're doing. And you don't really have to know techniques. You don't have to do anything fancy. Just simple movements um, is enough to get the job done.